Charlemagne say the gang dunk it of the day. You are a donkey. <laughs> it's time for donkey of the day. Donkey of the day does not discriminate. I might not have the song of the day, but I got the donkey of the day. So if you ever feel I need to be a donkey, man, <laughs> hit it with the heat. Yeah, it's a breakfast club, bitch. Who's donkey of the day today? <laughs> Donkey of the day for Where Tuesday, October 4th, goes to Odell Beckham Jr., okay? The New York Giants star wide receiver who has millions of young men across America rocking the blonde burst fate. Uh, now, lately, let's call it what it is, Odell Beckham Jr., he's been acting like a bitch, okay? A whole ho out here in these streets. Mm. Uh, let's read some of these headlines. This is from Yahoo. Emotion gets the better of Beckham again. Uh, the New York Post, Odell Beckham Jr.'s mood swings are killing the Giants. USA Today, Giants Odell Beckham losing grip on reality after losing cool again versus Vikings. The Sporting News, Odell Beckham Jr. really, really needs to chill out. Why are they saying these things, you ask? Because Odell keeps having temper tantrums. We all sit back and watch the TV and ask, what's wrong with the baby? Why he upset? Last week, he got into a fight with a kicking net and lost, and this week, he lost his cool after being flagged for taunting when he shoved Xavier Rhodes and then bumped into an official. Now, it's nothing wrong with being extra aggressive to your opponent. I enjoy a little taunting, but in order to properly taunt, you have to be up. When Odell started taunting last night, the Giants were down. 14-0. And that was only Odell's second catch on his way to a career low 23 yards receiving on three catches. Now add that to the fact that Odell Beckham Jr. has more mini meltdowns this season than he does touchdowns. Zero through four games if you're keeping score. Then you start to realize we might have a problem here. What's the problem? Well, if you ask me, it's a classic example of too much, too fast. Odell Beckham Jr. is a sports star in the biggest market in the world, New York City. And everybody can't handle that. What did Odell's buddy Drake say once in that record dra draft day? Uh, what the F happened to so-and-so? Where did they go? They too worried about bitches and fashion. They go mission in action. Now, I don't know if Odell is worried about the bitches. Okay? Shut <laughs> but, up. But he's definitely into his fashion. And as of right now, October 4th, 2016, he's missing in action. Now, Odell is young, so he can get out of this funk. Okay, he can get out this funk that he's in, but in order to be able to get out of that funk, he has to hold himself accountable, okay? You have to take responsibility for your actions, and Odell Beckham Jr. doesn't seem to be doing that. Let's listen to what he said after the game last night. Just out there playing football, you know, it's a man's sport. Um, you have to protect yourself at all times, and I just got to know where I'm at. I just got to know that, you know, it's, it's all against me. It's, it's going to be that way. I have to assume that I'm always in the wrong, no matter what. Uh, and that's just, that's something that's, you know, it's a tough pill to swallow, but you have to understand it. You, you have to be able to cope with it and, um, you know, just keep it moving. Like I said, this is a man's sport. Uh, and I'm not going to be out there just taking hits. You know what I mean? It just, is, it just, it is what it is. Now it warms my heart as a Dallas Cowboy fanatic to see and hear this. Okay, but let's be clear, Odell. You, you're not getting targeted for no reason. The refs aren't picking on you, okay? And you not getting calls or being targeted has nothing to do with the several passes you dropped in the second half last night. Eli Manning was giving you the chance to make plays, but you weren't making them. And instead of just owning that, you decide to blame referees and people making you a target. Negro, please. You're a target because coming into this year, you were a superstar wide receiver. Of course you're going to be a target. That comes with the territory. And when you know this, you have to rise to the occasion. And all that bitching and moaning you're doing about refs and people targeting you, you're just trying to distract from the fact that you aren't performing well. Odell, look, in life, we all have to learn to take responsibility for our bad decisions. Once you take responsibility, you learn from it and let it go. Don't blame others or make excuses for yourself because you can't change the circumstances around you, but you can change yourself. That's the only thing you have charge of, and you just need a simple attitude adjustment. That's it. Simple and plain. Your hair is more difficult to do than making an attitude adjustment, Odell, okay? I'll leave you with this. Most problems are not really problems at all, but simply a matter of attitude toward a given life condition. Change your attitude, change your condition. Please give Odell Beckham Jr. the biggest hee haw, please. Oh, you know what? Yeah, let's sing to the sweet baby. Sweet sounds. Sing to the baby. Give the baby some sweet sounds of the hammer tones. Come on. You ahead. are the donkey of the day. You are the donkey. Yeah, you can't have that nice blonde burst fade for nothing. <laughs> Four games, zero touchdowns. I wasn't listening. Who we give Donkey to? 
Oh, you tuned out? Yeah, I tuned out. Who was he talking about? Oh, man. Odell Beckham Jr. believes in stock. Don't do that. That's right. Don't, don't do do talk it. about my our giants. giants. That's what we do. Don't my on the floor. Man, don't don't do on the floor. Do what Stop Odell it. would do. Do what Odell would do. There you go. Oh, oh, I, no, not, I didn't mean touch him there. Okay. I didn't mean grab him there. Uh, wow, everybody okay? All right. Okay? Yeah, all right. All right. Uh, did you kiss him? Uh, oh, 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 there you go back. Oh, there you go back. Oh, my God. I think he just. Somebody dropped and broke something. Oh, my goodness. All right. Well, thank you for that donkey of the day. That was very awkward. All right. The Breakfast Club.